I'm so grumpy. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's time to sit back, relax, and enjoy another indie game. This time, Cassette Beasts has a demo. I'm excited. I loved mixtapes back in the day, so I'm ready for any game that references that. Uh, and so let's jump in. It's the Steam Next Fest demo, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what they have in store. The retro feel, uh, sort of the fresh, fresh look at a retro sort of genre, I think will be really cool. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> the nostalgia is real. We've got cassette tapes, we've got the snowy screen. Now rides this night through the realm- Well, I could not. I'll catch that later when I edit. <laughs> Who are you? Ooh, alright, let's type our name in. Kim Chica, favorite color. Ooh. 14, oh gosh. I mean, I do love- I do love a good yellow, a good marigold skin tone. I'm one, I would say. Pretty close to one. Hair color! Let's go with a nice uh, pinky tone. There we go. I should say that matches pretty closely. Hair accessory color. Ooh. Um, I can't quite see what the hair accessory looks like from this angle. So let's just go with... Um, I don't know. I think the green is kind of fun. It's bright. Face. Eyeshadow. Oh, beard. Beard too. Grumpy. <laughs> I could just be grumpy. Yes. Face mask. Face paint. Oh. I like that the, the sprite keeps rotating because it helps me get a good sense of what it looks like. I'm not seeing anything change color. Uh, I think it was at 18 in the standard, so let's just stick with that because I don't know what it is. All right, let's apply and save changes. Here we go! <laughs> oh, I'm so grumpy. <laughs> All right, I guess let's uh, move it on up. This two and a half sort of pixel art style is, is great. Two and a half D. Uh, Basic resource. Okay, so we're collecting resources. I honestly, from what I have seen of this game, it looked kind of like a Pokemon style game to me. It looks like I can I can jump. I'm seeing if maybe there's a sprint. Oh, look at the ways I walk with such authority and power. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh, I'm fighting a Pokemon that's a safety cone, a cassette beast that's a safety cone. This is so cool. Hey, stranger, don't make any sudden moves. Traffic crabs. Traffic crabs don't take kindly to strangers, or anyone for that matter. Here, take this. Wait, I want a cool, like, headphone cassette tape. Can I have a cool animation like that? Okay, quick question. What's your aesthetic? Big question. Needs spooky or sweet? Ooh. See, I feel like I would pick sweet, but it's spooky time. It's October when I'm playing this. I'm gonna go with spooky. Yeah. Also my grumpy face. Yeah, I can see that. In that case, take this. <gasps> Band sheep. Oh. <gasps> I love band sheep. Also, up here it says scene one out of 120, recorded one out of 120. So we have 120 cassette beasts to collect. Bio one. The eerie moans of the wild band sheep at night have led many to believe that they are restless undead spirits. But this is untrue. They are very much alive. They just like to have a bit of a whine. <laughs> Who doesn't? <laughs> Uh, raise this monster's tape to five stars to unlock more information. It's Habitats Unknown Bootlegs. Oh, so it looks like we might be able to add types, perhaps? Bootleg, like, yeah, hmm. And stats. All right, now just pop that in your cassette player, put on the headphones, and press play. <laughs> this might get a little weird, but follow my lead. What? Oh. Wait, wait, wait. Cassette Pokemon is, is it, wait, the words. Pokemon meets Digimon here? Your turn, don't be shy. 
<gasps> I am boo sheep or whatever this was called. Just breathe. You'll adjust in a moment. Right. Let's give him hell. Oh my god, this is amazing. All right, sheer, sheer luck. All right, let's do a nice, just regular attack. Oh, I'm controlling my friend too. Spit. Dodge. Miscellaneous. Call for help. 50% chance to summon a temporary ally. Well, let's just go with spit. Oh, one hit wonder. Here we go. <laughs> the animations in this are so good. And it looks like we can have maybe five cassettes in our back, sort of our backup team. You handled yourself pretty well there. Uh, what's your name? I think she, there was like a slight Scottish accent, so I'm gonna do my best. I'm Kaylee. I'm Kaylee. Nice to make your acquaintance, Kim Chica. Anyway, we should probably get you warmed up before you freeze to death in your pajamas. I apologize for anyone who is Scottish. I'm. Um, I will do my best. All right, I like this is this is a city. This feels um, not you know super medieval or like some of the Pokemon nowadays go are going back to like a medieval Japan feel. Um, this is sort of well, I don't know. That looks like a boat on a house, so I don't know what kind of era we're in. But it's there's jeans in a sweater, so it feels relatively modern. What do you think? Pretty quaint, right? What is this place? Welcome to Harbor Town. <laughs> Your new home. Uh, my new home? My face. Uh... All right, yeah, sorry. I'm not very good at this part. I don't know how to best break the news. You're stuck here. We all are. What? My head is spinning. Oh, and wonderful. This music, it's nice. Ah, oh, wonderful. You're awake. Kaylee gave me quite a fright when she came knocking at my door. <sighs> it had me scared for a moment, Kimchika. I don't think it's anything serious. Transforming for the first time is quite a shock to the psyche. Anyway, Arbor Town happened to have a spare home available for you, so this is your place now. On Where on earth is this place? On earth. Kaylee, you haven't told her? Sorry. I, I should have. Not to info dump on you, but you're on an island called New Wirral. Wirral? It's not strictly Earth. At least, that's what we think. Is there a way back home? I'm afraid not. Oh, okay, Dr. Pensby seems to have more of an English accent. I'm so sorry. Castaways have been trying to get back to their worlds for a century, and none have succeeded. A century? <laughs> but, but you'll be okay. There's a community in Harbor Town, and we help each other out. It's not a bad life. And it's safe. Well, apart from the monsters, like the one we fought before? Yeah. Actually, I'm going on a patrol soon. If you'd like to join me, meet me by the gate. The one just over the bridge we crossed to come into town. In the meantime, feel free to say hi to your new neighbors. I'm pretty sure word has gotten round that there's a new lass in town. Uh... We also fetch some clothes for you, though they might be a bit out of fashion for your era. But it's all we have. Might my, my era. So sorry, sorry. I'm info dumping. I'll catch you soon, right? We can talk more then if you'd like. My clinic is nearby. If you need a checkup, feel free to visit. This all must be a lot to take in, but we all went through the same thing once. My perpetually grumpy face is gonna stay that way, because it looks like we have traveled into a parallel dimension of sorts. New quest. This is the world we live in. Speak to Kaylee at the Harbor Town East entrance. Okay, what I love is that this map is showing me that there is going to be a pretty decent amount of placed places to explore. I don't know if this is going to be one part of the world or if this is the world itself, but that's pretty cool. 
Okay, a ranger handbook. Oh, I love the way that the little map shows up. That's cute. So I can see that there's three squares above that I haven't explored, but the uh, the three that I'm currently sort of in a row with and the three below, I can see peaks of. All right, so X. Oh, this is awesome. And at any point in time, I can change my face, my hair, my everything. Kind of like this visor. It feels a bit more futuristic. Oh. That's why the accessory makes sense. Ooh, let's do this. If we're in a futuristic, random, arid world, I want to look the part. Mailbox inside the house. Yeah. <laughs> okay, the game pointed it out too. It's not just me. It's a letterbox. How strange that it's indoors where nobody can deliver letters. Check it anyway. This will connect. Interesting. Okay, let's try it. There's a keypad at the back, though. Will you enter a code? Uh, let's enter... I don't know. 0725? 1? Submit? Huh. I wonder if there's a way that we'll be able to connect with our friends. Maybe send notes, cassettes across internet? You know what I miss? Sports. Why can't Harbortown start a football team? Well, I suppose there'd be no one to play against. I don't think the giant crabs on the beach have a competitive spirit. I mean, there could be inter-team, inter-city teams. Hey. Are you new here on the island? The look on your face gives it away. Also, because I'm wearing, I'm the only one wearing a visor. No one else is cool at, whoa, you're cool. Huh? Have you been to the west side of Harbortown yet? Been meaning to visit the Heritage Center over there. I mean, yeah, it's been a hundred years, so there's at least, like, one solid generation, maybe two generations have lived here. So there are potentially kids who have grown up in Harbortown. It's open across the bridge, but it's been raised for a while now. It's fine. I can stay on this side of town, I guess. Alright, and I've got two bars, which... They both are green, so I don't know what they indicate. One, I would assume, is my health. Welcome. Hey, Kim Chica, what can I do for you? So supplies. So we have rewind, respool. Oh my god. So this is cool. The stuff that we can get. Wait, are we paying in Legos? Are the this is definitely Lego pieces. What are these? Oh Goodbye. my god. Okay, so we'll we'll come back. This is amazing. Who knew that in an alternate universe, currency would be Legos? <sighs> Honestly, pretty handy to carry around, just stick them together. You're new to the whole cassette tape transforming thing, huh? A little piece of advice for you. The key is not to think about how it works. By all accounts, it doesn't make sense. But it does work, so just go along with it. Alright. I'm willing to do that. Okay, so we can't go into every house, it looks like. That's cool. I'm willing, I'm willing to... To suspend my disbelief. So this looks like a record store, perhaps? Gramophone Cafe. Bonjour. Bonjour. It's not too often we get a new face in here. Especially not one as pretty as your own. Oh, I guess it's maybe more of a French accent. I am Clemence, and this fine establishment is the Gramophone Cafe. What can I say? I own many records, and I brew the best coffee. Not that there is much competition. Please, feel free to ask me any questions. I am in no rush. All right, well, what's on the menu? Okay, so we've got iced latte. Thank goodness. Okay. We're in a, another dimension, but at the very least, we have Bonjour. iced coffee. Oui. When I arrived in Harbour Town, the people here were crying out for a place to socialize. A place that must be stylish. I made that place. If not me, who else? The town had a gramophone, an old machine for playing musical records, so I took this machine and I made it the centerpiece of this new establishment. But the people, they cried out to me, Clemence, you have a gramophone but no music. Well, one day, the rangers find a place, it is filled with intact records, so they bring them to me, they lament it. We have the records, but they are made for the modern record players. Our gramophone cannot play them. I said to them, shush. 
and I fixed the gramophone and now we can play the records. Now my cafe is stylish and it has music. Everyone is happy. The end. Bonjour. How did you get here? I fell. Landed in the ocean. Washed up here. About ten years ago now. If it is what it is. I miss motorbikes. Oh, I would miss motorbikes too. I have a special method. And the pipers call me coffee beans on their farm. It is a good arrangement, oui? Bonjour. Au revoir. Au revoir. Just as, as with the Scottish accent. Is this a coffee cup? <gasps> Cute, I can carry a coffee cup. Yeah. If you ever get stuck, try asking around town. Sometimes a good rumor will put you back on the right path. Right. I can't use the gramophone. The loading screen is so fast, but it looks like there was something that it said, but it's so, <laughs> the game is loading too quickly. It's like lighting something's fire. I'm gonna have to freeze that frame later. Ah. For 101 years, this town has stood. Did you know that? I remember what this place looked like as a little girl. The town changes so much so fast, but the foundations, they have always stayed the same. Sorry. Sorry, bud. You'll have to come back later to use the elevator. I'm doing a few long overdue repairs. All right, so you're a main character because you got a profile. Uh, what was my... I, I gotta find my friend, right? Uh, inventory, consumables. I love this, this rotation, though. Oh, that's such a good detail. Okay, so east of Harbortown. Okay, so we're on the right way. Yep. All right. Oh, and I love we can mark our mark our quest marker, all of that good stuff. Hey. Hey again, Kimchika. Are you feeling a little better? You know, you held your own the last time we fought together. So, well, I've been given an errand and need a helping hand. Do you think you'll be able to help me out? I'll explain in just a moment. You see that path there? Well. There was some kind of quake or monster activity last night. You can see the cracks on the ground. We're gonna check the path and make sure it's safe for crossing. Hmm. Here, take the key to this gate. Da 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 da. Alright. Removed from inventory the gate key. Oh, what's this over here? Uh. Uh, right. Uh, there's some basics I gotta show you first. Hope you're ready to turn into a monster again. <laughs> You'll adjust in no time. It's like riding a bike. Except, you know, it's with the bike transformed into a moody floating sheep. Also, you're the bike. Hmm. You see that creep with the boots? The spring heel. And it's gonna get aggressive with you if you get any closer. So you're gonna get closer, of course. Alright. And then we're gonna transform. Transformers! Alright, so we're gonna fight. Pay attention to these orange squares. They are action points. Ooh. Most moves require you to spend some AP. So if you don't have enough AP, you can't use it. You gain two AP and one extra if you land a type advantage attack. That's really cool. Okay, I like that element of strategy. So we can't smack them quite yet. So, let us... I guess... How do I... Oh, smack doesn't require any HP. I see, I see, I see. Um, so let's do spit. We'll stay on the offensive. You've taken a bit of a beating, but your monster form can take it. The green bar represents your monster form's health and the red is yours. If a form loses all of its health in a fight, its tape will break and need repairing. Not only that, but any extra damage from the attack that broke it will apply to your health, the red bar. If both of us lose all our health, then we'll have to retreat back to Harbor Town. Got that? Right. Let's crack on. 
All right. So it looks like 20. So we're, we're this is going to be a little bit more of a battle than last time. But well, we now have four AP. So let's try battering ram. That seems a bit more exciting. And why not call for help just to see what it does? <laughs> well, no call in for help needed because we did great. I look so cool with my visor. OK, so we've got some metal and pulp, which looks like we'll be able to maybe bring on um, yeah. what to call it like bring in more uh, resources to the village and make the village a better place to live too. Nice work. Hmm, that elevator should be functioning. There'll be a switch around here to turn it back on. Okay, the elevator switch, huh? Elevator switch, see? Here we go. Hey. I love that little perspective change, the little whoop of the camera. Let's head up, shall we? I'll let you take the lead for any more fights, but don't worry. I'll be sticking with you from here on out. Nice. So what's kind of cool is, um... <laughs> instead of collecting creatures, it looks like we'll both collect cassettes to have options to pick from ourselves, but also we'll have friends with us to have more than just us on a party. Serenades are particularly loud creatures and can amplify their own singing voices through their microphone tails and wings. They don't seem to have much awareness as to whether or not their singing is too loud for those around them. Awesome. All right, so let's follow Kaylee's instructions. Woof. Oh! <laughs> Wait, you had a jetpack. How do I get that? Do you need a break, Kinchika? We can rest here if you'd like. No, I'm okay. These bonfire pits mark areas you're safe to set up camp. It gives you a chance to repair your tapes and heal up. Okay, so let's use X to camp. Is there anything fun? Ah, oh, yeah, we do. We have a little campsite moment. Okay, so we, I have a hundred wood pieces. Um, we have party, tape storage, so let's do rest. Okay, so it is wood. The two of you have fun throwing twigs into the campfire. That's cute. I'm interested to see if there will be other ways we bond with characters um, that we've teamed up with. Tape storage, no tapes, party. Awesome. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so it looks like we'll have five team members. Now will the day change? It's nighttime. And there are no more creatures. There will be more monsters about, but we can take them. I haven't seen you around here before. Let me guess. You washed it pretty recently, did you? Ah, oh, is that a cassette player you're holding? Here, take these. Oh, awesome. Fully restores the HP of one tape. Uses up a turn when used in combat. All right. See another one of the bats there. I wonder how we can, like, capture one of these cassettes for our own. There. You see that monster? There must be a way to get it to come over here. Um, I mean, can I use this light? What does it like light? There we go. The moth to a flame. Okay. Take these. Basic tape. Records monster forms with a normal efficiency rate. Nice. There's something about the monsters on New Wirel. Wirel? Wirel? When wakened, their essence can be well recorded to cassette tapes. We don't know exactly how it works, but it does. And that's good enough for us. All right, so it looks like this is going to be our first catch. Now, I will probably use spit because I would guess it won't catch on the first try, but we'll see. Yeah, 28%. Oh, okay, so it's going to take time to record. <gasps> oh, and I wonder if the recording speeds up with a lower HP. That might be the case. Dominoths. <laughs> Dominoths. See themselves as defenders of peace and spend their days patrolling the skies of woodland areas. The only thing that can distract them from their noble duties are bright lights such as lamps. It's cute. 
Various factors go into a successful recording. How much the health has, health the monster has, its level and rarity, how much you deal, dealt it while recording, and how much damage you took. Using status effects to buff attacks that target the monster can be an effective way to increase the damage and improve your odds. And as long as a monster is being recorded, it cannot flee or be defeated, so you don't have to worry about knocking it out. Oh, that honestly just drove me wild when I was playing Pokemon. Okay, so let's switch now to, oh cute, transform. So it's recording it, so I still have to defeat the creature that's there. A new, if a monster takes too much damage, it'll flee, so you won't be able to record it. You with me so far? Oh, so do we have to still defeat it in battle? Or if once it's recorded, it's good. Okay, let's try Sonic Boom. Uh, it's a whole team, but I also just want to see what it's like. Victory! Nice! Alright, Banshee just leveled up and I obtained Zephyr. Hmm. Cool. And now they're the equipped Cassette Beast. Is this meant to happen? Uh, some forms give us uh, extra abilities when we record them, beyond just being able to take their shapes. Don't panic. I can glide! Hold A to glide across long distances. This consumes stamina. Sorry. Probably should have warned you, but I thought it might be a little easier to show you. You can use this glide to get across that gap right there. Oh, okay, and that's how we can get over. Okay, can we climb up this? No? Where's my... Oh! If I can do it... Oof! Okay. Hmm. Oh, hold on. We've got a lever here. We should probably do something with that. Upper path. Oh, that'll get us up. Okay. So that'll let us maybe go back and forth. Oh! Huh? What's going on? This is because of monster activity. We better stay sharp. Let's go. All right, so we've got our traffic crab. Whoa! And a big puppy! All right, so let's do smack and spit. We'll build up our AP here. It's called a dandelion. Okay, for monster design, I give this just a 10 out of 10. These are super cute. I love them. They're playful, fun. I don't feel like they're too weird. Like, they make sense. <laughs> okay, battering ram. Sonic boom will be good because that'll get both of them. Uh, I think what I probably... Oh, you know what I should have done? With Traffic Crab is probably finished. Oh, yes. Um, oh, yep. Traffic Crab is finished. I need to record. Air type attacks can uproot plant type targets, disconnecting them from their ground. Ooh, AP drain, gain one fewer AP. Oh. All right. So we are going to record. Basic tape, use on dandelion. Fight, you just spit. Just spit on them. Okay, we're at 49% already, which is good. 73! Bali! Oh, I love the little sticker! I sure hope they have those stickers available. Dandelions are loyal defensive guardians. They're typically found standing at the entrances to important caves in the grassy plains of New World. If you find one with no cave nearby, it may be a hint that something is hidden. Kidoki. So now we just gotta finish this little guy off. Thank you for letting us record you. All right, the battle was won. Yay! Oh, cute wallop. Nice. Oh, 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, you felt that one, right? Oh, we might have a boss battle on our hands. Oh, or a dungeon. What, what is that? Oh, was this always here? I just got here. I don't know. This is a normal? I've never seen anything like this before. Is this always buried here? Oh, investigate the strange structure. All right, here we go. Seeing the all seer. What huh? does that mean? Is this a train station? Should be okay to take a look around, right? Oh, I don't know. This sounds pretty ominous to me. A. Bars are never a good thing. Hmm. Oh, I see some... This place smells like burning metal. Can't explain it. Are these... Are these cassette beasts? No. Bought some plas <laughs> plastic. Definitely not logos or Legos. TM. Kim Chica, can you feel something in the air? Oh my gosh, we get cutscenes. We get animated cutscenes. Stop! This is terrifying. What? Is that you, Mordred? Come closer, child, so that I may see you last one time. One last time. <laughs> this is... This is... The long conflict has drawn to an end. I am afraid he has defeated me truly this time. Kimchika, I, I think this is an arch archangel. We need to leave now. This isn't like the other monsters. We are not safe here. So dark! What the heck? Who are you? No. No, you are not my kin. You come for me once again, sword in hand. Oh no. Oh, broken spirit. Whoa, you can tell this is a big boss level one. Oh no. Oh no. I just can't, I can't stop this music. Oh my God. Okay, so we've got raise the user's melee attacks. Ooh, that's good. Okay, so let's sharpen. Um, can we call for help? I don't know, let's try. I I have a feeling. Oh, Traffic Crab heated the call. Thank you, my buddy. I mean, we're gonna get knocked out in one hit. Or not, what? Okay, lowers target's accuracy. This is good. Um, okay, so the green bar is actually, you can see the, ta the edge of it. It's not totally full, so they were already, like, damaged quite a bit. Okay, type advantaged attacks immediately break walls. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Unlike other monsters that spend AP to use moves, Archangels accumulate all their AP until it reaches 10. And then it really, oh, of course, of course it has a limit. Okay. Use your moves strategically to either set up a solid defense or defeat it before it gets well. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay. Um, sharpen. Uh, let's do, I guess, let's use an item. Okay, use on Traffic Crab. No, I want to use it on my buddy. Oh, here we go, Sirenade. I mean, hopefully it doesn't one hit KO me, but. I'm not gonna die here, not like this. Do you hear me, Kimchika? This isn't the end for us. It can't be. I refuse! I refuse! 
we're gonna fight this thing and we're gonna do it together. Kimchika and Kaylee's hearts act as one. <gasps> Power Rangers! Mighty Morphin Power Rangers! When your goals are aligned with those of your companion, you can fuse to become a singular, more powerful beast. <gasps> Fusion. You gain 4 H AP each turn instead of 2, access to both moves and combined stats. Oh my god, this is so anime, I love it. Okay, power 60, let's do this. Okay, oh my goodness, this is gonna be rough. Goodbye, traffic crab! All right, let's see. I don't think we can do anything. So let's try and raise our invasion and see if we can dodge this angelic attack. Ooh. Bam, we survived. All right, use on, I guess, ourself. Yes, yes, yes. All right, fight. Let's do saw. No. Okay, here. You know what? I'm gonna raise our melee attack. Just one more. <gasps> oh my god. I chose this. Oh my god. I just need to go offense. I just need to go straight offense. Missed. Okay, it seems to be missing 50% of the time, approximately. Power 30. Okay, so let's do battering ram. The status effect won't work, but that's okay. It looks like we can do one more hit. Here we go. Yes. Yes. Oh. Ooh, yeah. Almost two, three levels gained. All of up. Uh. How did we? I don't know. Your stamina increased by 20%. You can now glide for three seconds. Oh, that's cool. Enough. My time is drawing to an end. Why have you come to this wretched place? I want to go home. I want to be specific, not just off this island. There might be other islands. I want to go home. I see. There is a way, but there are none who know the path but I. I require a vessel, and you require a guide. Rebuild my strength, and in turn I shall lead you from this land. Vessel? Very well. Hear my song. <gasps> Am I now an archangel? If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the past most long. The rest of the quiet song is too quiet to make out. <sighs> what is hidden in that? What is hidden in that? Where's the cassette tape? Ah, Kimchika, are you okay? What happened? Y you blanked out for a second there. We should get out of here. Hmm. A lot happened at that train station. I guess we should probably talk about it. Um, okay. Uh, the Archangel. I mean both. Let's start with the Archangel. Archangels. Supposedly, when the first unlucky sods washed up on the shores of New Wirral, they thought the monsters here were angels. And some of them wrote of other entities too, greater than the others. Creatures that look and feel wrong. Logically, they called those other creatures Archangels. The highest ranking among the Order of Angels. Of course, when people learned they could fight and defeat the regular monsters, they lost their angelic allure. And they've had a bunch of names over the years. Angels, demons, devils, ghouls. We just call them monsters now. It's a good catch-all term. Those other creatures, though, like the one we fought, they're still archangels to us. We don't know what they are. No one has really seen one for a long time, looking at that thing we fought. It's hard to explain. It felt like I wasn't viewing it correctly. Like trying to watch a movie through binoculars or something. Sorry. 
Sorry, I'm making some assumptions there. We're all from different worlds, after all. <laughs> <laughs> you might not know what movies are. <laughs> what are movies? Just kidding. <sighs> Phew. Okay. Grand. I love the way the music dropped out there, too. That was a good little comedic moment. I've been in New World for three years, and I've still not completely learned to adjust my cultural references when I talk to new folks. That is fusing. <laughs> oh yeah, that. Fusion is a rare phenomenon known by the rangers. There are fused monsters in the wild, and supposedly the leader of the rangers can do it too. In the right circumstances, two people in monster form are able to unite and form one powerful being. The Megazord. I guess the right circumstances include being nearly killed by an archangel. It felt strange. In that moment I was sharing a body with you, and the thing we became was both us and not us at the same time. It was among us. <laughs> I I've never fused with anyone before. I certainly wasn't expecting to fuse with someone I barely know. <laughs> Just kind of happened in the heat of the moment, right? Sorry. Sorry, talking about it's a little awkward. I mean, it's awkward if we make it awkward, right? <laughs> like so many things. We wouldn't have... S it helped us defeat the Archangel. I guess you're right. Now that we've done it, I have this weird feeling inside me. Like a, a door has been opened that I didn't even know was there before. I, I feel like I'd be able to fuse with you again if we ever needed to. Aww. So... Let me get this straight. That Archangel, Morgante, and her memory is inside you now. And she knows a way to leave New Weryl? There's even a chance that this can lead to a way off this island and return people to their homes and their families. We owe it to everyone on New Weryl to find you out. You and I! You and I! What do you say? Are we in this together? We don't have any other option. No, of course I won't say that. Let's do this. Relationship level. Okay, so this is this is interesting because we can fuse with people in battle, fuse with our friends. Looks like maybe. I don't know if there's like romantic. The hearts make me feel like there may be romantic options later on, perhaps if we choose, which is kind of cool. Um, I'd love to know if like it's required or if we can just be like intimate, like really close intimate friends and not be in a relationship like romantically. I like it though. Fusions you form with Kaylee now have 5% added strength. Building relationships is important. You can take a break at a campfire in the cafe. Basically, uh, anyone who's played Fire Emblem Three Houses, that's what I've played at least from the Fire Emblem series. It's reminded me of that. Um, that's really cool. I enjoyed it in that game and I'm excited to see it in this game too. If an archangel gave you that vision, then you need to find another one. I need to be strong enough to stand against it when you do. All right. Land of Confusion. Locate Archangels to complete Morgante's song. And follow the clues it contains to find your way home. The Rangers have a training program that will help you become a strong that will help you become strong enough. Let's begin by getting you a meeting with the Ranger leader. She'll be at the outpost in the park right about now. All right. Take me up. Wait, are these quest song titles? Take me on, take on me, ah, be gone, in a day or two. <laughs> All right, so let's exit. And we have a bunny to follow us. Oh, this is so cool. Painting brush room. Angry guy. Oh my gosh, angry guy is a cool jacket though. My goodness. Don't make me tell you again. Harbor Town won't fall to you, bloodsuckers. So unreasonable. Oh, hello. <sighs> Crawl back to the darkness you came from, or you'll have to go through me. I fought your kind before and won. Do you want a demonstration? <clears throat> we shall leave for now. But in time, you shall understand that we know what's best for you all. Yeah. Tell the rest of your kind that this town is protected by Eugene. <laughs> yeah, Eugene. Let me know if these creeps bother you again, ma'am. 
Whatever you do, don't invite them into your house. That's what they want. Thank you. I will keep that in mind. Thank you for intervening, young man. Eugene! Oh, hey. Sorry you had to see that. My name's Eugene. Which, I guess you know, because I just yelled it at those guys. I'm Chica. Everyone in this town is so cute. Uh, what was that all about? Hmm. I'm assuming they're vampires. I won't trouble you with the details, but they don't belong in this world. Let's just say not all the monsters in New Wirl, 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 look like serial mascots. Anyway, I gotta go stake out those guys. Can't risk sinking them sinking their teeth into the good people of Harbortown. Uh, can I help? <laughs> if you're willing to get your hands dirty, I'd be glad to have you assist. Meet me at this location. I'll give you the full lowdown when you're done there. <laughs> Acting on your best behavior. I would- I'm curious if this is a song title and I just don't know the reference. Just prepare yourself for a throwdown. Things might get kinda ugly. Dang! Alright, so we've got- <gasps> Shoot! I was really hoping we'd maybe get one more quest because this is so good! This is the end of the demo. For both of us, only two people? What? Only two people made this? We hope you've enjoyed this little taster. You can continue this save file in the full version of the game. Thank you, devs. I appreciate that so much. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we are definitely going to be playing more of this game. Cassette Beasts. I love it. I love that we've got more. I feel like a really good number of monster collecting games have come out relatively recently, and it's been so nice to see them um, between Temtem and like Ooblets, which is kind of a sort of collecting. Yeah, it's a monster collecting, I would say. We've got cassette beasts like, oh my gosh, there's there's one other um, Koromon. That's been really good, too. Like really wonderful games derived from, inspired by and like iterating on Pokemon and many other monster catching classics and it's so cool i love to see this uh i love that it also is a bit smaller like 120 that's something that's manageable for me uh sometimes i get a little intimidated by the new pokemon games because there's just like hundreds and i don't have the time to collect and catch them all anymore but this is this feels doable and i like the story i like that it's got something different to it so Please wishlist the game if you have also caught this has caught your eye. And find me on TikTok and Twitch at Kimchika. I highlight indie games there as well. TikTok, lots of short form recommendations, fun videos. Twitch, I do both demo playthroughs live with you all as well as longer form let's plays. And um, of course here where I showcase a lot of demos and uh, indie games too. So. Have a wonderful day or night wherever you are. Hope you find lots of indie games to play and I'll catch you next time. Whoa. By not smacking the microphone, I will catch you in the cafe. Bye y'all. <laughs>